Hey my friends, it's Alicia Stringer here. Always empowering success streams. Thanks Hal Hislop for joining and all those that hopped on that I don't get to see their URL because they're probably on the web. Um, this is about some positive reviews from Facebook reports. There is, um, it's very, thanks Alexandra, I think that's how you say it. Um, when you are looking out on social media and you're finding ways to engage with your audience is very powerful, most powerful to share results. And I know I am a slacker of sharing results. I feel like sometimes it's a way of showing, you know, mm, more of an ego sometimes in a way or stuck up that I'm in it, you know, that um, you're just always producing results or something. So, um, I have a hard time. I'm not that like red personality to sh always show results. So I am in the factor that I'm getting out of my comfort zone to share some more positive results some different things I'm testing out that is working because it seems like there's something always wrong with what everything I'm doing. So I always need to share the positive aspects of it and things that, um, but I'm, I'm fairly certain that you're going to enjoy this report. So this is, um, we've done this for, this is for month of July, pretty much the whole month. Um, I was doing some ads for a client and, um, we did some, um, basically a campaign straight to their, um, to get capture leads and go straight to their shop to straight to their sales page, I think. So we were trying to test both of them. And um, then we started doing some like um, campaigns on it. And it's very powerful to see the difference on the different type of ads you're, you're running inside of Facebook. Um, give some hearts or share in the comments if you are doing some Facebook ads and would like to know some insights of you know how you do your reports and what you're looking for. Any comments there, just give me some feedback. This is um, my spreadsheet that we put together of all our reports. And um, this is the month of July. And the things that I'm looking for is um, the click-through rate here. And I've heard that it's very positive to have it over 1.2, <clears throat> really. And so we had some really good click-through rates um, of two, um, pretty much straight all the way down and a lot of these, and it was very powerful. And this is the um, just the click-through rate here and you can see from the clicks. So I think that was pretty powerful to have a positive click-through rate um, that we were getting some pretty good ads out there. Another thing that um, I was looking for positively, see if I can scroll over here in our reports, um, is the relevancy was really high. I'm not sure if I can find that um, in this report, but um, I always saw really positive relevancy in there. See how we started to get some more page likes in there. Um, wasn't much action in there. <clears throat> you can see some of the website clicks um, in there was taking more action. Um, so we've really had a, some really good campaigns that I think came out of it. Um, I want can't really share with you the sales. I really don't know what the sales from were from that, but they were starting to get some more subscribers, at least some more leads in there. Um, I really don't see the the um, the relevancy score in here. Um, maybe I should go make sure I click that next time. Reach, click the rate, clicks, oh well. Frequency, impressions, clicks, oh well. I'm not seeing the relevancy score, but they were relevant like 8, 9%, which was really positive on there. So we got a lot of page likes and a lot of website clicks and more um, subscribers. This was just from literally nothing. They had less than 25 fans on their fan page and starting to do some page likes and um, now they have almost a hundred um, and this was you know just less than a month because we started this beginning of July so there are some campaigns and so I can really see some true growth I know it could be better but um, there's when you're tapping into a niche that's um, really specific and it's not like a trend out there although it kind of could be but it's um, something that more business like you're trying to get sales for a certain product um, it's very tricky on how you balance how you're doing your ads and things so there's so many different factors that come into play um, when you're doing your ads and 
fa varying factors. So it all kind of depends on different things. But I just wanted to share with you some positive things that I got from the campaign and learning a ton um, is the um, click-through rate is really high. We're getting some really good feedback from that and some of the actions and getting more subscribers. So it always seems like it's growing po more positive and trying to stay really focused and narrow like that to get that going. So the process that I did on this was they're creating a blog post of value and then we're doing a capture page to the blog post and making sure all our pixels are aligned and getting subscribers. Now now it's time, now that we've done it for about a month, is to um, do a new ad to retarget all these people that click through um, to our websites targeting with just those pixels, then we can do a retargeting ad, a new audience um, from that because we targeted certain people in certain regions. We targeted um, every few days. I changed up the age. Um, and then after we we're doing a region, we started another region and changed up their age again. So we're doing a lot of different types of testing with very niche, very narrow audiences on there. So it was very positive to get that going. All right. so. Make sure that you always share positive results out there. That was something positive that I'm learning inside of you know doing some Facebook ads and growing my niche audience with doing all these periscopes. So I'm excited. Get on the team call tonight. Make sure you um, message me. You say, hey, I want to be on your team. You got to get inside this team call to get inside of um, more Facebook. I mean, there's some major Facebook gurus in here. There's um, international people that are taking it um, to to the world. I mean, they're growing their 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 team by the world and everything else. So go to, to alishastringer.com and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.